Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, we will see how we can uh, add security level permission from uh, Iceland cluster itself by using chmod command. Before proceeding further, let me tell you how a security level permissions looks like. So this is one of the folder. So if we are right clicking on it and select properties, here one tab will be there, security, edit and uh, add options. So whatever username and groups you are adding it here that is called as security level permissions the same thing we can also do it from uh, iceland command line we need to use ch mode command to provide security level permissions from iceland ch mode is not included in isi it's basically a unix command iceland engineering team has modified it so that we can use it to provide security level permissions as well So execute the command man ch mode hit enter to see the available options i will discuss some generic options so generic options are nothing but the equivalent options for full control write permissions or the modify permissions so if we will press tab for few times we will be able to see the generic uh, options here so here we go so dir gen read it's basically says that uh, the user will have only the read level of permissions so directory gen write will have the write permissions execute will have read and execute permissions and uh, if we'll see uh, here directory gen all this means the user will have the full control in this example we will provide full control to one particular user first of all let's see what are the existing security level permission for one particular share in order to get that list you have to execute the command ls hyphen led and then give the full path in this case i will give ifs and uh, smb this command shows the security descriptor of this uh, particular directory we can see it's mentioned as synthetic acr so synthetic acr is nothing but it's the pictorial representation of uh, a DACL into mode bits. I know it's a bit uh, complex for the beginners, but uh, just accept it. So once we finish with the command, this synthetic ACL will be gone and we will be able to see the DACL and one more plus symbol will come here, which will indicate that this particular directory has DACL. So let's start, execute the command ch mode, then plus a, this means we are adding one more uh, entry hash and then give some numbers these numbers are nothing but the entry at which the new account permissions will be added here we can see 0 1 2 so i will be using here 0 here so this will not remove the existing permission it will just add one more entry and whatever existing permissions are there it will be shifted by one more number so now just hit enter to see what are the options present here so ch mode uh, this this doesn't give me more information so type user this also doesn't give me much information let's complete the command and if any errors are there then we will try to resolve it so user then you have to provide the username here it will be guest then what type of permissions you want to provide is it allow or deny we will provide uh, allow and then what level of permissions we want to provide that is those generic options so our option will be dir gen all for full control now if you want to replicate these permissions to subdirectories and files then you have to give it two more options that is uh, container inherit or uh, directory and then object inherit or uh, file then you have to give the complete path for which you are providing this security level permission one more thing here that you have to provide here hyphen r so that this command will be executed recursively so let's hit enter and see so we haven't got any error this means this command is uh, now if we want to see the current permissions execute the command ls hyphen led then the complete uh, path that is slash ifs smb hit enter one more entry came off here guest and it has the permission directory gen all 
and the all other permissions are also restored nothing has gone and uh, one plus symbol came here so wherever you see the plus symbol it indicates that uh, acl permission is uh, there so that's all for this video i know this video was somewhat complex for the beginners but uh, once you have uh, hand on experience with permission levels then these things will start making sense to you so if you have any questions please uh, comment do subscribe and again thank you for watching